Today is Monday, May 16th. It's 8.52 a.m. Good morning. Today is Vesak, or Buddha Day, a traditional Buddhist holiday honoring the life and teachings of Suddhartha Gautama, the founder of Buddhism. To all those observing, I wish you a reflective and peaceful holiday. Hello everyone, it is Princess underscore Mini4 and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today's date is Monday, May 16th, 2022 and it is 9.25 a.m. Today I have an 11 a.m. laser hair removal appointment and then when I get home, I will be bringing you along on my journey because my, my first summer class starts today. It's my seven week summer class. And yeah, I will explain all about it when we get back home. I don't know about y'all, but I have such a texture issue when it comes to certain things. Like, I don't know what it is with grits, but it's, I mean, with um, oatmeal, but it's like, it's, it's just too slimy. And it's like the oats look weird and they like they get all in your teeth like I don't like oatmeal anything really anymore but I was at the store and I saw it I was like I had oatmeal in a few years and then I realized why I remember why I don't so for breakfast we're gonna be having these they're just little pretzels I just can't do oatmeal anymore I don't know what happened I ate it every day as a child I don't know all right you guys so it is 10 20 a.m and I am heading out so this is what I'm wearing some leggings, socks, and some Crocs. Let's go. All right, you guys, I'm at my laser hair removal appointment. I get my unibrow, my underarm, and then I get a Brazilian. I'll see you guys when I leave. All right, you guys, I am back home. It is 12.58 p.m. So two things I have to do today is obviously I want to, you know, like everything I, every time I do every first of the semester, I write down when all the work is due in my planner and then I write it down on my to-do list on my phone. So it pings me when to do the work. And then obviously like to try to figure out what I'm doing with this semester. And another thing is I'm studying for this praxis core test that i had to take in july so i'm also going to be doing that today as well i do that monday wednesday and friday and i'm also going to have me do this schoolwork on tuesdays and thursdays so i have something to do every single day so i'm not bored over the summer because i am not getting a job this summer just because i'm studying for that test i'm preparing to move on with my college career and it's like i have a lot of stuff to do i have four classes so i'm not going to force myself to work as well because you know these part-time jobs are so demanding and they don't really care if you're they don't really care about you they just care about getting that money in so no all right, you guys, so I'm going to tell you what class I am taking. So this class is called Tech 101, and it's called Career Readiness 1. And the course description is, this course is part of a three-part sequence of career exploration courses. This initial course provides a career exploration introduction. Students will perform, perform personal and career assessments and develop job search and interviewing skills. This course is geared towards students with limited professional slash career experience in their field of interest or studies. So the only reason why I took this course is because I needed 10 credits a class. I have three classes that are three credits. That gives me nine. And this is a one credit course just to get me to 10. Like, so this is probably something you're probably supposed to take as a freshman. I was never recommended it. So I really kind of think this course is going to be a breeze, but yeah. All right, you guys, so. I printed out my syllabus yesterday. It says the name of my school at the top. But they opened the course up two days ago. So on the 14th. So I came on here and I printed a syllabus. So I just stapled it. Now I'm going to go through it like I always do. If y'all been a long time supporter, I'm going to highlight important things and we'll go from there.
this planner actually ends in June, but I'm good for now. So I'm on May and so black is events, brown is important, purple is test, red is homework, pink is quizzes, and then we have deadlines. So this is like, you know what a deadline is. So I basically go through here and I use this key I wrote right here in these and I'm just going to write when everything is due. So on my plan, I write when everything is due. And then on my phone, I write when I'm going to do it. So that's the difference here. Yeah. This planner ends the end of June, June 30th. So I bought this other planner right here. So this one is going to be from basically until the end of 2022, so December. So one of my, my last work for this semester is due on July 10th. So I'm gonna have to write it on here. And I already have my test in July. It's actually three tests, it's split up between reading reading writing and math so july 9th july 16th and july 23rd that's why i'm studying three times a week for this test but yeah i just wanted to let y'all know that I just feel like I wanted to tell you guys so we do have a textbook for this semester and it is called getting from college to career which is kind of cool um, but I'm also gonna start working on the introduction form I did my introduction form I'm like the only one that's ever done it but then again the class literally just started today so and he also said well they also said I don't know um, that it's actually not um, mandatory you're not getting graded for it but yeah so I'm looking at the stuff for unit one unit one is not due until May 22nd which is really only like five days from now but it's like I'm either going to start working on the work tomorrow or on Thursday just because my mind doesn't work at this time of day. It's 1.30 something or 1.40 something now. And like I said, on Thursday, I don't have anywhere to go other than the laundromat. I don't know. I am so busy this summer, guys. Cause it's like, we're trying to get rid of my great grandma's house. I don't know if I ever told you, but my great grandma passed away last year in May. So we're trying to get rid of her house cause nobody lives there. Why are we paying the bills? So that's something that I'm doing as well. And then I'm studying for these exams. That's why I was like, I'm not getting a job this summer. 
and I don't like doing work later in the day, but I guess I'm gonna have to train my mind to do work later in the day because it is what it is. Sometimes you just have to be open and be like, what's the word? Lenient, I don't know if that's the word. You just, you have to be able to do stuff regardless. Like I'm gonna have to teach myself how to focus at this time of day, but it is almost time for my lunch and I've only done one thing, so kind of irritated but it is what it is all right you guys so i have elio's pizza for lunch it is 208 and i'm still working on my school stuff all right you guys so the time is 2 20 p.m i'm pretty much done everything i can do for today i started to work on some of the work that is not due until the 22nd and uh so now i'm going to start working on this practice core test i have to take this mixed math practice it's a timed mini section so that's all i'm gonna do today just because it's 220 and like i said i my brain don't work at this time of day say hi london and yeah so we're gonna be doing some math all right you guys so it is 3 30 p.m and I think I'm actually going to end the vlog off just because, I mean, it was supposed to be like a day in the life, but I'm like irritated by a lot of stuff going on behind the scenes. And I don't want to bring that negative energy onto my video or on my channel at all. So I'm just going to end it off here. I uh, started my new class and I worked on my Praxis core and that's just basically what I'm going to be doing all the time. So yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Turn the notification bell to know when I post and share this video with your friends. And please watch all the videos on my College Chings playlist. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.